back to another video. In today's video, I have got a new train, Edward from Thomas and Friends. I got him for my birthday. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing a little skit on how Edward arrives to the Serracoville. So we now have the steam train on the track and he's going to go pick up Edward from the Ford dealership where he was just shipped. Hello, I'm here for Edward. Of course, he's right here. We'll load him on for you. Okay, he's all loaded up. You're ready to go. Oh no, the train broke down. We're gonna have to have another train come out here and pick up Edward. So we now have the steam train on the tracks and we're gonna have the steam train help the abandoned diesel train. Okay, the steam train has made it to the location. We are going to uncouple the diesel train and we are going to hook up the diesel train to the steam train. Okay, the diesel train is all hooked up. Now the diesel, uh oh. Don't know what happened there. I don't know why the diesel train fell off the track. Okay. Well, the steam train and the diesel train are hooked up. So the steam train is gonna take the diesel train back to the yard and another train will come pick up Edward. Okay, so we now have James heading towards Edward to pick him up and push him to the destination point. The bridge tipped over. The bridge isn't tall enough for Edward to go past. This was definitely not planned to happen. We're gonna put the bridge to the side, make things fall over, put the people back on the bridge. Now that the bridge is out of the way, let's keep moving. Oh no, a horse escaped. Oh no, the train hit the horse. <laughs> oh 
Oh no, the horse fell in the pond. Don't fall in the pond. Okay, the horse made it safely back to the pen. But now there's a big crash. Spencer is going to come over and help James and Edward. We're going to couple up James. And we're going to pull him back to the yard. Okay, James and Spencer have made it back to the yard and we are going to have Edward go around the tracks. So we are gonna pretend that my hand is a crane lifting Edward back on the track. Okay, so Edward is now on the tracks, and since he has always been capable of moving himself, he's going to take himself back to the yard. Okay, so finally in today's video, we are going to have Edward pull a coach car around the layout. like Edward derailed. Okay, now he's back on the tracks. Okay, so now on to the fun fact of the day. The bullet train. The staging of the 1964 Summer Olympics in Tokyo presented Japan with the opportunity to show how far it had progressed since the devastation of World War II. The nation decided to showcase its engineering capabilities with the Tokyo Shinkansen, the world's first high-speed rail line. Construction of the electrified line, which ran 321.6 miles and linked Tokyo with Osaka to the southwest became, began in 1959 and was completed in 1964. Service began on October 1st that year. The line carried the world's fastest trains, which earned the nickname Dangan Risha, bullet trains. Because of their speed and the distinctive shape of the lead car reaching a top speed of 130 miles per hour, the train soon made a journey in a record-breaking 3 hours and 10 minutes. Popular from the outset, at peak times, the service ran at 3-minute intervals. The first line carried more than 150 million passengers in its inaugural year. Its success led to more routes on the island of 
Honshu and Kaishu, enlarging the network to 1,483.6 miles. Engineers also designed faster models and tracks. Even the original O-series trains were modified, reaching a top speed of 137 miles an hour before they were retired in 2008. Thank you everybody so much for watching today's video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye.